Hey, what's up, guys? I'm doing another playthrough of That's Not My Neighbor. Yeah, welcome back. I'm, I'm addicted to this game. I don't know what it, what it is about it. Like, every, every playthrough is different. That's what I love about it. Hey, what's up, buddy? Steven Rude Boy. I had a request to, to do a playthrough without looking at the folders, but I think I'm going to wait till we stream this game to, to attempt that. So we're just going to do a, a normal attempt. But we only have four people. You know, I'm going to restart this one. I like when we have like eight people. Can I, how do I restart? All right, we'll do that again. Do the intro again. Hey, what's up, guys? Just joking. Uh, oh, whoa, whoa. All right, all right. Calm down, game. I wasn't happy before. Oh, here we go. What's up, Celine? What's up with your... Why do you have little hands on your face? My appearance? They are my arms. Like the arms of my a normal human. Normally humans don't have arms on their chin. I'm gonna have to call the the DDD on you. Alright, that one that one was a layup. It was too easy. Alright. Next. That one was too easy. We're looking. We we do need our sister though. Illinois. Hey. Is that who the hell is this? Marguerite Bubbles. Who the hell are you? I've never. I don't think this is the first time I met you. <laughs> Where are you? Floor two. Room three. Oh, she lives by herself. Seamstress. Curly hair. Deviate, deviated left eye. Alright, that's definitely, I think, deviated. Round nose, big smile. It's the biggest smile ever. She loves life. She's a seamstress. Somebody was telling me to. Hold up. Where's your ID? You only have to look at the first two digits and the last two when you're inspecting the ID. So 10 and 90. All right, you're good. Marguerite, 1975. We are expecting you. Deviated left eye. All right, well, looking good. Let's do it. Welcome. Welcome home. Next. Gloria. How are you doing late? Where's uh your husband at? 69 and 50. Wait, I got I guess I got to look at the the floor. Good good. The mole is on her right side, which is correct. Nose is good. Eyes. She's got those golden eyes. Resident. Come from my job as a banker. She is a banker. Gloria Schmidt. Are we expecting you, Gloria? Oh, no, we're not. We're going to have to call your husband. 5123. Hey, Arnold. I got your uh, better half here. My wife is not home. All right. She is back, but we don't. Unconfirmed. We're going to have to question her. I had to leave due to an emergency at work. work. All right, I believe her.
yet. It's got the correct ears yet. Next. Hey. I don't know if I've had this guy before. Isaac Goss. How are you doing, buddy? It's quite the smile. <laughs> Come from my job as a reporter. Big eyes, big smile, prominent chin, big nose. Yeah. Looking good. Blue eyes, too. 45 and 69. Reporter. Are we expecting you? We are expecting you. Alright buddy, 1965, Isaac. Interesting way of spelling Isaac. Got a couple extra letters there. Next. Hey. <laughs> Raftalin, the vampire. Something up with your ears, I can't quite get over that. Those are definitely vampire ears. 56 and 29. 1962. Raftalin. Went out visiting your parents. Alright. I'm just going to be honest with you. Raftalin. No way. I'm letting you in. You're not even on the list. So I'm going to... Call the DDD. Pretty sure you're, you're a vampire. There we go. I should have questioned her about her ears. Like, are you Dracula? Next. Hey, Roman. How are you doing, buddy? Job as a public accountant. It's got the scar. It's got the hat. Scar on right chin. Long face. One eyebrow. Wears a hat. We are expecting you, too. 48 and 84. Good. Um, yeah. I'm gonna say you're good. Welcome. Welcome home. Next. Only one, uh, doppelganger today. What's up, buddy? Dr. W. Afton. Have we got Dr. Afton before? 1971. His nose. His nose looks a little off. Resident in the building. I'm come from my job as a phys physicist. Where are you? Floor three. Oops. Room one. Oh, yeah, he's got Mia Stone as his wife. Physicist. Yeah, look, his nose. I knew it. 25 and 14. Good. Your nose is off. I think everything is fine with my appearance. <laughs> Are we expecting you? We're not even expecting you, buddy. the CDC. I know, not the CDC, the DDD. Thank you, buddy. Alright, next. It's her. Anastasia McKaylee's live here. Apartment is four on the second floor. She's right. 
tired eyes, two ponytails, small nose, brown face. That's correct. One three six two. Good. Nineteen eighty five. We expecting you? Yeah, we are. Yeah, she's she's good. Welcome home, Anastasia. Stay out of trouble. Next. Alf. What's up, buddy? 1960. 12 and 47. I think he's on floor... Wait. See, I, got, I have to memorize these. I want to do the, the no folder challenge. 12 and 47, you're good. 1960. Prominent mustache, monocle. Wears a hat. Round face. Is the correct eyebrows? Yeah. Nose as well. Oh, William Afton had your nose. Um. We are expecting you too. Lawyer. Yeah. I think you're good. Pretty sure you're good. Welcome home, Alf. Have a good day. Next. Hey, Mia Stone. 78 and 15, 1978. Floor 3. Room 1. Long hair, small, round nose. Oops. Good. Pearl necklace. Oval face, thin eyebrows. Yeah. 78 and 15. Good. Are we expecting you today? No, we're not. I. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> like eat people? Can you uh, explain why you like to eat people, Mia Stone? I don't see anything wrong with it. It says you like to eat people. I'm gonna have to call your husband. What's your phone number? 1425. That's a hundred percent. I think that's a doppelganger, but let's just make sure. Dr. Afton speaking. My fiance and I are in the apartment right now. I knew it. I knew it. No people eating for you today, Mia Stone. Get her out of here. So we know Dr. Afton's home and Mia Stone. So anytime we see Dr. Afton or Mia, we know for sure that they're home. What's this guy's name? Angus. So buddy, floor... Apartment is three on the first floor. Lives by himself. 56, 45. Good, 1968. Um, see what you you match your profile pick that we have on record. All right, you're good. We are expecting you to. You have nobody to call, so if I call your, well, I guess if I call your apartment, if you answer, then we'll know that you're a doppelganger, but. We are expecting you today. So that means that you're probably not in your apartment. <laughs> I may be overthinking this, but you're good. Next. Hey. 
Yeah, you're Afton's kid, right? We're not Afton, uh, elves. Buddy. Paperwork. <laughs> you forgot. Just gonna stare at each other. Oh no, you're rude boys, kid. 56 and 65. Where are you? Floor 3. Room 3. Yeah, McCloy's kid. You got the same nose and everything. 56 and 65. Big nose, wears glasses, short hair. Small head. That looks kind of small. Those eyebrows. Well, he's got the, kind of the same eyebrows as his uh, dad, so... He's a pilot. Resident of the building. We are expecting you. Yeah, we are. Uh, 1966. The nose? For some reason, the nose looks a little off. I think he's good. Welcome. Next. Oh. <laughs> Why do you have a mouth on your face? Or a second mouth? Illinois. We are expecting you, but... Yeah, what's up with your... Your cheek? What's wrong with my appearance? No, 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 no. <laughs> Nothing's... Nothing's right with your appearance, I'm sorry. That was another layup, that was too easy. Next. Who else do we have? Illinois... And Albert. <laughs> what's up, buddy? Uh, what's up with your eyes? You got noses for eyes. <laughs> that threw me off. Two noses? Yeah. Don't we humans have two nois noses? No. No, we don't. Where's your ID? Let me see your ID. ID? Alright. I could have looked past the two noses, but you not having an ID? I can't let you in because of that. So, you are on the list, but I can't... I can't let you in with no ID. Sorry, my friend. Tried to pull a fast one on us. Get him out of here. Next. Hey, I've been, been waiting for you, buddy. I think you're the last person on our list. Albertski Peachman. Uh, floor one, room one. There he is. Fourteen fifty-four. Good. Nineteen seventy-four. Albertski Peachman. I think that's him. That looks like him. Yeah. The eyebrows and the chin. Alright, you're a shoemaker? Yeah. But you know what? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to do the achievement. Uh, I think you're the last person for today. Definitely. So I'm gonna have to call the DDD on you. Just for the achievement, I'm sorry. I had to, I have to do it. Continue my job. 
I think that's the last person. Oh, it's not. All right. Oh, wait. Was he the <laughs> the doppelganger then? I I I I was killing him because I thought he was human. It's your your appearance, buddy. Where's your stash? Alright, uh... Unless you shave today. You got a mustache on your... On your paperwork. Where's your ID? 11.54 Oh. You got your ID no number incorrect as well. I'm sorry, my friend. Your ID is incorrect as well. Uh, you are on the today's list. But... Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why uh, the day didn't end, guys. Because we still have Illinois. I completely forgot about her. We got her twice, but she was... Both the times she was... Uh, a doppelganger. We still got the we killed the human, but yeah, this guy's definitely a doppelganger. Just for shaving. Don't shave around me, guys. I'll send you to to the DDD. All right. Next. Oh, Angus. Buddy. But another guy that shaved. And I, I think I left I let you in earlier. Yeah, where's your stash? You actually look way better with the stash. Come from my job as a businessman. Long neck as a mustache. Alright, your ID, your appearance. What about your, your appearance? Fifty-six forty-five, nineteen sixty-eight. You're a very convincing doppelganger, but you just missed the stash. So, sorry. And I let you in earlier. There you go. Get him out of here. Next. Illinois. I've been waiting for you all day. Illinois. Floor one. Room four. Mole on left cheek. Yes, she does. Small pointed nose. Yeah. Slim, long neck. She has a twin. Yeah. 84 and 56. Good. 1980. Triangle earrings. I think uh, Celine has the square earrings. This is kind of an important piece of information there. Um, you are on the list too. Yeah. Alright, I'm comfortable with letting you in. Yeah. Welcome. I'm pretty sure that's the last person today. Oh! What the hell? <laughs> It's not. What's up with your uh, your third eye there? What's up? Yeah, what's so strange about my third eye? I think it's a very normal third eye. You don't even have eyelids for it. How does it stay moist? Stephen Rudeboy, 1966. 
Well, you're obviously a doppelganger. <laughs> I like what they say when you when you question their appearance. I got you another one here. I got you so many today, and one human. Next. Oh no, there we go. End of the day. Hey. Oh, I killed one neighbor, look. I got the achievement. There we go. No doppelgangers. We got the achievement for killing a neighbor. Kill one neighbor. Cool. There we go. Oh. There we go, guys. Another playthrough of That's Not My Neighbor. Uh, yeah, still a fun game. <laughs> I enjoy playing it. And I'm going to keep playing it until, uh, I don't, I, I don't know. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll take a break from it, or we'll, we'll do a stream for it soon, I promise. But yeah, we'll just keep playing it. See how long we can go. Plus, we've got a couple of other achievements that we have to do. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.